Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are previewing the upcoming international friendly between the United States, Bosnia and Herzegovina. This friendly will be played at the Dignity Health Sports Park, the home of the LA Galaxy in beautiful Los Angeles, California. That stadium does feature on the virtual red patch that I use, so we have it for you here on the preview. Unlike most of the rest of the country, Los Angeles still feels a bit summery this time of year. It doesn't get too cool in that part of the country, so short sleeves abound. As these two sides head out under the lights. Miralem Pjanic, Ed and Zeko and company coming to the U.S. It's formerly known as the Stub Hub Center, now it's the Dignity Health Sports Park. Los Angeles. Alright, as the two sides complete their pre-match festivities and prepare for kickoff, let's take a look at our starting lineups. For the U.S., they line up in a 4-3-3. Christian Pulisic, the talisman. Jesse Zardes, the striker. Paul Ariel on the right wing. Weston McKinney and Michael Bradley with Leggett in the middle. Four at the back, Zach Stefan and Net. For Bosnia, the Christmas tree formation, a 4 3 2 1. And Jekko up top, Marilyn Pjanic in the middle of the formation. Your players to watch for Bosnia and Herzegovina. Here's a look at Marilyn Pjanic, Paul Ariola. Keeper for Bosnia. It's Michael Bradley. We're going to use the Merlin CONCACAF ball since we're in a CONCACAF stadium here under the boot of Jesse Zardes who kicks things off for the USMNT against Bosnia and Herzegovina. This should be a really fun matchup. The two sides fairly evenly matched in my eyes at least. Uh, the, the top end talent, Pjanic and Dzeko. Uh, Probably rated a bit higher than anyone in the U.S., save maybe Pulisic. A lot of players in the U.S. playing in the Champions League. You got Pulisic for Chelsea. You got Weston McKinney for Juventus. John Brooks for Wolfsburg. You got Serginio Dest for Barcelona. Not in the Champions League, but you got DeAndre Edlin for big club in Galatasaray, Zach Steffen for Manchester City, so this U.S. team's got a lot of talent. Bosnia as well, so this should be a really fun friendly. here looking for that opportunity there it is oh! it is Jesse Zardes the U.S. just giving too much time in and around the box Position that we all are still trying to figure out sometimes. You know, Josie Altador, Jesse Zardes, Josh Sargent. Sargent, of course, playing for Norwich City and things Premier League. Well, the Jesse Zardes today, and I am rewarded. It's 1 0 to the U.S. men's national team over Bosnia and Herzegovina. Let's see how they respond. Shortage of talent in Bosnia and Herzegovina. Ball in and Jekko. 
Dzeko nowadays. Uh, he's, of course, played for Manchester City and Roma in his career. Now with Inter Milan and the Marazzurri, holders of the Scudetto. Mirlin Pjanic recently moved from Serie A Juventus to Barcelona, and more recently from Barcelona to Istanbul to play with Bishop Tesh. Another Champions League side. This goal kick should bring it into the first half, and it's 1 0 on the Jesse Zardes goal. USMNT take the 1 0 lead into the half. Let's take a look at our halftime stats. Currently in favor of the U.S. Uh, Bosnia just couldn't win the ball. The U.S. in their in their third for quite a long time, passing it around, poking and prodding, looking for space, looking for a chance to advance and shoot a goal. And finally, they find it. Jesse Zardes converts. One nil. We'll see what kind of tactical adjustments we get from Bosnia and Herzegovina in the second half here look for a way to get forward and look for an equalizer under the lights of the Dignity Health Sports Park in Los Angeles, California. Christian Pulisic, the talisman the U.S. men's national team. Of course, plays his club football with Chelsea in London. The holders, the European holders, certainly among the favorites to do that again, along with Manchester City, Liverpool, PSG, Bayern Munich. Maybe throw the Real Madrid in there, perhaps. It would be about it for the list of teams I think could do it, barring something unforeseen. Cross into the box, nobody home. John Brooks, the Wolfsburg defender, chases it down, sends it out to Chelsea man Christian Pulisic. Robinson looks forward to Zardes. Jesse Zardes looking for Paul Areola. Can't quite connect. Bosnia and Herzegovina looking to advance. They win a foul. They win a free kick. Oh, actually, they don't. It was offsides. All right. Seventy-second minute. Bosnia and Herzegovina still looking for an equalizer here. From the Jesse Zardes goal. John Brooks in strong. The Wolfsburg defender wins possession for the U.S. Brooks, Kenny, Pulisic, strong left side for the U.S. That's the side I've been trying to work down. Zardes header, a brace for him. Being rewarded for my decision to go with Zardes and strike the hero. Good decision for me today. 2-0 to the U.S. 81st minute. Pulisic out to Weston McKinney, the Juventus man. Sends in a pretty nice cross. Zardes sneaks in between the two defenders and heads it home. Bending could have been a little better there from Bosnia. I think Zardes could have been kept out of there by those two defenders. He went right between them. They could have squeezed him out. The keeper could have grabbed that cross. And Bosnia still had plenty of time to equalize. With two goal deficit, nine minutes doesn't seem like a lot. Well, seven now. Result. Scoreline may not be settled yet. The result likely is, barring something miraculous. 87th minute, U.S. again moving forward.
just possessed. He's a little wild in possession there, but that's it. The ref blows the whistle. That is full time. US 2, Bosnia and Herzegovina nil. Jesse Zardes Brace is the difference. He'll be the man of the match honors for that. So let's take a look at our highlights. From the Dignity Health Sports Park in Los Angeles, California, Jesse Zardes kicks us off. And in the 28th minute, Paul Areola, the nutmeg pass, finds Jesse Zardes, knocks it home in the bottom corner. Pulisa here, back out to McKinney in the overlapping run. The Juventus man sends in a beautiful cross. Zardes splits the two defenders, heads it home. 2-0 to the U.S. They would not look back. That is your final from the Dignity Health Sports Park, the home of the L.A. Galaxy. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If there's a picture you'd like to see me play, you can leave it in the comments. If you enjoy this type of content, please subscribe to my channel for more. Again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.